All right, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Rock, man. Coming back at y'all with some more Black Ops action, man. Uh, I get a lot of requests for this. Uh, this is a game I actually play a lot more now because I just came to grips with Modern Warfare 2. That that game is, I ain't gonna say it's not for me. It's just that hey, they dropped the ball. I don't, I don't give a fuck no more. Uh, you know, I play these games to have fun, so I'm gonna go to the game I have fun playing. And when I went back the other night, actually a few nights ago, when I was doing my live stream, I just had so much of a ball with this game, man, that. That I, I, this, this is the game I'm playing right now, straight up. I mean, I hop on Modern Warfare 3 every so often, but for the most part, this is what I do. And this gun right here is so fun, man. This uh, Gold Spaz 12 I got, man. I was been going crazy, man. But uh, with this commentary, man, I just want to come up on here and talk about, talk about some ideas that I thought of that would probably make um, Call of Duty a little bit better. And, um... You know, I, I'm just trying to, I've been, I was sitting back and I was trying to think of how they can make things better for Call of Duty. And, uh, you know, so basically, here we go. Um, basically, you know, I know you guys hear a lot of people say that they should go back to the 357 streets, which honestly, I agree. Personally, I think on the next uh, Black Ops, um, my opinion, they should go back to going to 357. But for the elite players, you know, Go to five nine eleven or five nine thirteen, whatever. You know what I'm saying? For like a higher higher set of kill streaks. But I mean, we'll just stay at the three five seven. I'll just give my opinion on that. Basically, with the three five seven, they should go back old school. Dogs, artillery, and UAV. And then, of course, keep the other old school uh, um, UAV, uh, airstrike, and then like uh, chopper, and then. You know, like just they could just mix it up. They could even have a lower kill streak, uh, three, four, five, like they used to when you started on Modern Warfare Two, and that's UAV. Uh, in my opinion, they should bring Predator missile back on Black Ops Two. Fuck Infinity War, bring that shit back. That's one of the funnest things in the game. But uh, but yeah, they should switch it up like that. And then if they if they do want to have support kill streaks, um. Make the support kill streets where it is strictly support. And if they do bring back the Blackbird, make it like how it is on from Modern Warfare 3. They had a good idea on Modern Warfare 3 were bringing in an advanced UAV. But they dropped the ball when they made it where you can't see people that use Assassin or, you know, from Black Ops like Ghost. So just make it where you can see it, but make it to the point where the opposing... Make it to the point where the opposing team can actually shoot down the, uh, the advanced UAV or Blackbird. And, you know, they can make it like where the advanced UAV would take like two two missiles. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't want just this one person to take out your kill streak. But, I mean, granted, since it is going back towards 357, you know, it, it might may need to get taken down one shot. You know what I'm saying? Like, maybe that could be like one of the, the kill streaks. Like, uh, it could be like... Three, five, seven, and seven is, is the Blackbird. Five is is the artillery. Then you get the UAV. You know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah, I mean, cause to me that'll make it a lot better. And of course, separate uh, Ghost like how they got it up on on Modern Warfare Three, but they tried to do right. Put Blind Guy and then uh, Assassin. You know, switch it up and uh, bring. Man, in my opinion, man, bring I ain't gonna say bring back secondary shotguns. Just bring back the shotguns from Modern Warfare 2. The real deal shotguns, man. My Spaz 12 just don't feel right. I heard they did the, uh they post that buffed the shotguns, made them a little better up on the Xbox. Um I haven't went up on there and checked. Uh even though I have the map packs, I should go on there. I, I wanna go on there and check on the shotguns. I'm really waiting for my XCM crossfire thing. I'm about to start getting nasty on the Xbox. I can't wait. <laughs> Boy, I can't wait. But yeah, man, so uh I don't know. Let me know what y'all think, man. What y'all think about the kill streaks and uh certain equipment. Like that's what I, that's what I liked about that they had right on Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops. That they didn't go overboard with the equipment. Now, I understand like uh with with the equipment that they want to make a way where you can stop predator missiles with the trophy system, but listen. <laughs> Ain't no soldier running around with no big ass trophy system like that, putting that shit on the ground. You know what I'm saying? So that, that's just my idea on that. Um, make make it back to 
Just keep it the way it was on Black Ops where you get your two clay. Was it two claymores? Or oh, it was one claymore. Yeah, I, 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 I think it's cool. Keep the one claymore. We'll let you get the two satchel charges or C4s. They should bring back the satchels from World at War. It's a lot of things that, in my in my opinion, they need to bring back from other games. Um, make a game type where they got the tanks, man. I used to like playing with the tanks. I didn't I didn't see the tanks as a problem. I used to love blowing them motherfuckers up. Cause people used to like trying to get in them. And then they'd be running next to them, trying to hide next to it. I throw two satchels at that shit. Get like a triple, quadruple kill. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you see, I got my other black bar. He was going down this game. I was having a lot of fun, man. <laughs> For real. Damn. Thought I was going to get my dogs right there. Oh, well. We are still getting nasty. I believe this game right here. This is uh, one of those games from the live stream right here. Uh, if y'all haven't, man, y'all need to come through to the live stream, man. You messing out on some nasty action. You know, I know I upload the videos of nasty action, but come through to the live stream. You get to see it live and direct. Uh, yeah, so I just want to apologize to all my subs that, that subbed to me for Modern Warfare 3. I mean, granted, I am still going to play the game. Don't get it twisted. Because it is a Call of Duty at the end of the day. You know, you want to switch it up. But out of all the Call of Duties that came out, that game, like, pisses me off the most. Like, it just, it pisses me off. Because it makes, that game make me feel so frustrated, man. And I, I don't feel, I don't know. I don't feel like I can counter shit. I don't feel comfortable with with the way they just got it set up. I don't like that there's no Marathon Pro. I don't like that there's no real uh, blast shield or flag jacket, you know what I'm saying, or tactical mask. And that, all those where I just said it eliminates a lot of the bullshit that happens. <laughs> For real. But yeah, man, you see what it is, man. It's been your boy Rock. This uh, pretty much winding down, coming to the end, man. I got some more Gold Gun gameplay. Uh, let me know what kind of guns y'all want to see, because, you know, I pretty much got every gun gold inside of Black Ops. And with Black Ops, even though I put a lot of time into it, it's one of them games, I, at least one of the Call of Duty games, I don't feel like I'm finished with, man, straight up. Like, with Modern Warfare 2, I was finished with that game. I had 43 days played. <laughs> In game, yes, 43 days. Yeah, I was, yeah, I know I was doing a little too much, but I was on a video game craze around that time of my life. But yeah, man, it's been your boy, Rock. Go ahead, rate, comment, subscribe. Tap that thumbs up button, y'all. All right, peace.